All right, with the holidays here, a lot of people have an awareness to give away to charities, especially with food banks. But did you know there are some things that are better to give away than not? I'd like to welcome Heather here from Lutheran Social Services. And if you can, walk us through, because we were talking about this earlier, and it's, it's pretty mind-opening of what is good to give and some things that are not so good to give. Because you would think with a charity, it's always good to give. Well, Mark, there are a lot of agencies right now doing food drives, and the Lutheran Social Service, we are one of those. We've been working to fight hunger in Jacksonville for the last 36 years. During the holiday season, everyone likes to give. You know, when you're in the grocery store and there's a buy one, get one sale, it's an awesome thing to grab a can off the shelf. There are some items that food pantries and food banks need more than others. Um, in front of us, you'll see a variety of items that people could use. Um, at Lutheran, we do four hunger relief programs, and we do feeding our seniors. We um, work with pregnant mothers that are at risk for having preterm babies. We do after-school backpack programs, and we have a community food pantry. Items that are good for us on that, when you're looking at seniors, you want to look for items that have low sodium. You want to look for easy to open pop top cans because on seniors, you want to think about cholesterol and heart disease. And they take a lot of medications that food has to work well with. Um, for our after school backpack program, we really look for things that kids themselves can make. Um, easy single serve cereals, uh, macaroni and cheese, instant oatmeal, raisins, things that are healthy for them to eat. We don't want to add to the childhood obesity rates. Sure, sure. And when we look at the Jacksonville population, mm -hmm. what does the recipient look like, the typical recipient, if we broke down the population? You know, is it mostly the elderly? I mean, you mentioned kids too. What, what would it look like? I, I think in all honesty, if you're walking around, you're seeing the population that's in need in Jacksonville. I think anyone and everyone is a paycheck away from being a recipient at our food bank. Most individuals that come in to see us in our food pantry are the working poor, so they're receiving income. They're just not making enough to make ends meet. And most of them have you know, one to two children in the household. They're either a single parent household or a family that's trying their best to make it. They're just not earning enough income to get there. Sure. And then also, too, when we talk about the times, right now the holidays are here, so a lot of people, they're giving, they're feeling good about the holidays. What are the lowest times um, that you see food come in? Generally, the holidays are the high times. In the summertime, take probably April through July. Those are our lowest times. And we're really in need during those times because those are the times when kids are home during the summer. Parents, you know, they're, they're worried. Yeah. Parents are working on paying sure, for childcare, yeah. so they're needing extra money to feed those kids. They're not in the schools. Um, right now in our school system, there's greater than 82,000 children that are getting free or reduced lunch. 82,000. So imagine in the summertime, those kids still need to be fed, and they're in your home. Right, so, so they don't have to... access to the food at all they because they're not. not in school. That's right. Wow, that's, yeah, that's, that's sad. It's very sad. So again, so the summertime, it's a good time. Obviously now, you need to go, and then I like this, so when you have the actual, the pop top mm -hmm. that opens pop like that, it's good for people, you know, the elderly yep. people to open. Yeah. Low sodium, because a lot of people have diet restrictions, so that's good. And then also, too, you think about the children as well, because they're recipients of this as well, right? Yep. All right, what's um, a, a great website, or where can we go to find out more information and get food to the right people? Awesome, well, we'd love you to visit our website, which is www.lssjax.org. Our website tells you about all of our feeding programs, how you can donate to help us, and it'll also lead you to other organizations in town that you can help with. Well, great. Well, Heather, thanks for coming on, and happy birthday. I heard it was your birthday uh, today. Thank so you happy so birthday. Much. Again, thanks for coming on. Great information. Eden?